All right, so I bought this off the Facebook marketplace. I paid £10 for it. It's a Blue Point electric screwdriver. I believe Blue Point and Snap On. They're basically the same thing, I believe. Well, I think Snap On bought Blue Point out. It does work, but it's a bit slow. But I know what it is because this is quite an old screwdriver. I know it's going to be the batteries inside it because they're not lithium, they're probably the NICAD type. Yeah, I bought this at the face of the marketplace, I paid £10 for it. It's even got a light, though. it's got clutch control. Got a light. It twists that. See the light there? Not that bright, I'm guessing it's because of the battery. It came with a charger as well. Plug a charger in there. But when I was charging the other day, that's when it was really hot, when we had them few days when it was boiling hot. It was in charging. The charger was really hot, it got really hot. And I put it on charge last night. And luckily, before I plugged it out, I turned the power off in my shed. But when I pulled this out, that just come off like that. Look, it got so hot, it melted. See that? See how hot it got? It melted the screws, the terminals. But I don't care anyway, we're not going to use that charger anyway because we're going to change the battery inside. And we're going to change it for a lithium battery. And see if that will work inside it, it should fit. But I'm going to cut this off. It's a bit here. See, we're going to open it now. Let's get this thing open. Hammer them two dot pins here to hammer out. This one out. Last one out. Right, so there's the gears. Let me zoom in. That is quite well made, you know. Got metal gears. See that the metal. And a lot of the other screwdrivers are taken apart. The gears are plastic. Look at that. A metal transmission. That is well made. I guess in the screwdrivers you're buying now, they're not gonna think it's gonna be plastic gears. So I might see if I can run. I don't know if it fit though, I don't think it will fit. A 2S LiPo. Because those metal gears will definitely handle 2S LiPo. Let's put it back in now.
Yeah man, just goes to show man, things are not made how they used to be made. Everything now, now this is being made cheap. On the cheap. Alright, we're going to put that to one side. Put that to one side. We're going to get this open now. Alright, let's get this open. See that it's got Sanyo batteries inside it. So we're going to take them out. So it's already sort of marked, so I know what is negative positive because the blue there is obviously negative. And the red there. See the red it's at the top. It's positive. Because sometimes they use they might use the same colour or different colours or negative and positive. So I checked online and these batteries, you can still get them but they're not cheap. They call them high drain, high drain batteries. But they are not cheap so we're not going to bother with that. Well, I'm going to get this battery out and the circuit board as well because I can use that circuit board to charge other stuff other projects. Alright. Cut these off. Yeah, Charles King and our boy, Charles. Yeah, I knew the Queen was on her way out anyway because I found it a bit odd that um, Meghan and Prince Harry are back. I think they come back about two weeks ago, that's a bit of a coincidence. So she obviously was on her way out. Alright, we use that as a charging circuit. Charge the battery. And deep affection is so widely held. And I think I think an appropriate moment to have the back of that Andrew to look ahead a little bit more. I intriguing line to me that this would be communicated in a merely factual way. What do you think that would be? Alright, we're gonna solder this battery in. No? Um, who's an, uh, an Irish author and she says a uh, brilliant story about the Queen and that's 
speech she gave in 2011. Uh, we've traced the envelope on which the President of Ireland, the then President of Ireland, Mary McAleese, had scribbled phonetically how to say um, the statement that she made, which meant President and Friends, and she said it in Irish, as we know, uh, which secretly made its way. It's a piece of paper with it written phonetically. One secretly done. made its way to Buckingham Palace. Both women had hoped the speech, because the plan was off the table. It had been vetoed. Uh, but Queen Elizabeth had other ideas as she wrote. So well, I don't know, draw that hole out a little bit. The British monarch to visit Ireland began her speech with that famous statement. She, lovely? she was always a woman with her own views her own about mind. things. She spent her entire life surrounded by uh, plus moves, an unfortunate, unfair word, but, but um, officials telling her not to do this or not to do that. And just from time to time, she rebelled and did exactly what she wanted. Well, perhaps, you know, she, perhaps she knew better. I think, I think sure, that's an example where she did she, she clearly did, in that she case, did. Didn't she? Yeah. Yeah. An unforgettable moment, yeah. an unforgettable moment. Um, and I'm afraid we are experiencing, for sad reasons, unforgettable moments, and we'll continue to do so over the next 10 days of mourning, um, in spite of the fact that Her Majesty the Queen, Queen Elizabeth II, um, The best soldier in battle works, I'm not an electronic engineer, it's a and hobbyist. And you and I spoke at length uh, during the plan that endured, um, um, while society changed, she didn't really some tape around there. Yeah. Yeah. Um, protection. We've talked throughout the evening, haven't we, about this being a sort of on a personal level as a family and then as an institution. So on a personal level as a family, we shouldn't lose sight of the fact that if uh, Liz Truss was told at 4.30 about the death of the Queen, that would have happened around that sort of time. And of course that was before some members of her family got to say to Aberdeen Airport or indeed to the castle in order to say their goodbyes. Well, I, I, I know of one member of the family, I went to it, who was stuck in a plane and unable to get there with it all going on, so it, was quite, it may well have been a bit traumatic. Just going back to the, the Elizabethan story. The to final hours, and she has been able to do that. Uh, we believe that the Duke and Duchess of Rothsey, as the Lord of Scotland, now King and Queen Consort, were here, as was the Princess Royal. Duke of York, the Earl and Countess of Essex, and the Queen's grandson, Prince William, all travelled here this evening, with Harry following a couple of hours later. But we should remember, of course, given that, that whilst this is a very public occasion, and it will... Time to put the gay box back on now. ...the behind these gates of our moral is... There was no evidence of that, and even in the real world... Change the battery. Case, you know, if that's the case... See, the light's a lot brighter now. You know, now, I mean, just throwing everything out the window and everyone's guilty at the first. <coughs> Excuse me. So here's the charger for it, the original charger, but we in, we're not using that. As it's um, output the six volts. And as, as I was saying before, it melted, it got really hot. So we're just going to pull this off. Pull this out. Get rid of that. We're going to chop this off. Strip it back. I think he will absolutely recognise the difference in the role of King and the role of the Prince of Wales. And um, I, I think he totally understands um, the role of the constitutional monarch. And um, he's observed it at close quarters for a very long time. And I think he will be an excellent king. But he has enormously large shoes to fill. Um, All kinds of events. Um, this, this is like no other that any of us have experienced, is it? I, I agree entirely. It isn't. Um, the, the only... Well, that's the, the middle I pin. Of, which bears the middle bit is the one, the white. Go along yeah, it. Alright, okay. Uh, so that's going to be the positive. So we're going to solder the wires. Where it says a battery. I know, I know if I engage you about Paddington, we'll be here till midnight, Frank. Listen, <laughs> a pleasure to have you with us this evening, particularly because of the two really happy moments that you and others with you helped to produce, uh, along with, of course, Her Majesty. Oh, 
just check that. Yep, that'll do. Let's wrap them up now. Yeah, so there it is. There's the charging circuit all made now. I know it looks ghetto, but it works. That's the main thing, it works. So where, where the battery was plugged into this, obviously as you can see I cut it off and the charging cable for that, I cut it off the charger, I soldered it to the battery um, wires on there. So the import, the USB plug in there, let me show you. I was supposed to charge it, plug it in there, micro USB, let's plug it in, see it lighting up there, so that's charging now. I'll probably use this one on the messy jobs. The ones with a low oil, because it's really quite old. But it works. As you can see, the gears inside it look very sturdy. Because it's quite old one. I guess things, old things are better made. Yeah, blue point snap on. I could imagine how much this cost when it first came out. It must have cost a bomb. And I paid £10 for it. I'm guessing the first come out that probably obviously probably cost more than a hundred pound but I think they're remaking you know? now I noticed some something with certain tools all it is they're just rebranded because I saw another one oh, no, I saw a Draper one in grey exactly the same as this exactly the same design but I just but it's just um, got the Draper logo on it on the Facebook marketplace so some of these tools are just rebranded really. So look it works, you know. Got it working, restored it by just changing the battery inside it and yeah. It's somewhat has got a lock in a bit holder. But sometimes you do have to turn it. Just a little bit for it to lock. It's the auto locking out of some of them, if you know what I mean. See, I'm not there. Let's go that out. Right, I'm just going to crack these engine mounts here. Three more Allen key. See them? Four of them there. See what I mean? You've got to turn it a little bit. Let's crack them first by hand. And I whiz them out. This is to do the gear, the gear mesh. It's some of my other screwdrivers are struggle with this because they got it's got a red lock tie I put on them because of the heat from the engine. Yes, yeah, that engine that move down, see it? Drop down. Now I can do the engine mesh now. Alright, the gear mesh is done now. We're gonna tighten up the two bolts in the opposite direction. And see, this is why I like these electric screwdrivers because when you're finished, you can just give it a manual tighten up. Say, so don't overdo it. Or if your driver ain't got enough power in it, you can just give it a little manual little push. And that's done. A little tightener. Alright. 
Yeah, I think that's done. Okay, so I've been using this Blue Point electric screwdriver for a while now, and I must say, this has got a lot of power to it. It has got a lot of power. Excuse me, excuse me. Because this will undo certain fastness my other screwdrivers I've tried struggle with. And plus, you can use this to unlock. To, 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 to crack like M10, not M10, the I mean M6 um, fasteners. Whereas the other screwdrivers, the screwdrivers are used, if you try and use them to crack, to uncrack um, M6 fasteners, you can hear it sort of creaking. You, you can feel like it's gonna break. Whereas with this, you don't get that. This is solid. It is solid. I guess they don't make them how they used to make them. Yeah, this is very strong, very solid. But it's not for. I wouldn't recommend this for the more delicate sort of jobs. Because it's quite big compared to the other electric screwdrivers out there. But it's very sturdy, this is hard wearing. Because when you use it to uncrack fastness, just like I'll say M6, you don't feel like no creaking as you do with the other ones. Yeah, and the battery does last quite a long time as well. Yeah, it's got a lot of power, this.